What's going on guys? I'm Jehovah and uh, today I'm bringing you something different, some uh, team tactical capture the flag. So uh, obviously hopefully you guys should know team tactical is a 4v4 game type and um, I think I'm playing here with G18 and let's see G18, KR Speedy and I think that was it. I think I think we went into this with three people maybe and then we got paired up with an I don't know I don't care anyways um, using the 7.4U um, arguably the worst weapon in the game it's pretty horrible no I'm just joking it's pretty easy to use but uh, I like it I don't know a lot of people bitch about it um, bitch about everybody using it but uh, I really don't I don't know it's effective obviously as you see here with my uh, triple flag defend um, but it's powerful, but I, I wouldn't say it's any more powerful than the FAMAS or the AUG. I think the FAMAS, the AUG, and the AK-74U are all equally just about as powerful as each other. Um, the only thing that, um, separates them that, that I can tell is recoil. Um, the FAMAS has maybe a little bit higher of a fire rate, I think, so it seems more powerful in certain situations, but, um... It's got the least recoil, if you ask me. Second being the AUG. The AUG has a little bit more recoil, and I think the 7.4U has the most recoil out of all three. But that's just me. That's just my opinion. So, um, in my opinion, out of the three, the uh, least newbiest would be the 7.4U. But that's just Jehovah talking, and nobody cares what Jehovah thinks. So, And I'm talking about myself in third person. This is fucking weird. Anyways... Yeah, Black Ops. Black Ops is fun. Uh, Christmas. Christmas was fun. What did I get? I got some. Um, I got some money. I got a bunch of gift cards for Walmart because apparently I'm hard to buy for. So I'm a fucking gaming nerd. But uh, yeah, I got a bunch of uh, Walmart gift certificates, and uh, so I think I'm gonna buy my um, my my Turtle Beach X41s. They're great for wireless, I guess. But they're starting to piss me off. They click and they they click and hum and make weird noises all the time. And the sound quality honestly don't seem to be as good as even the X11s. Some of the later models, some of the you know I've had Turtle Beach for years, but um, X41s actually seem like they're a little bit of a downgrade in so sound quality. And that could just be me and my settings that I have. I have no idea. Um, the wireless is great. But I go through batteries like a madman, uh, and I know everybody is like, "Well, just buy the um, the rechargeables." But even that is kind of a hassle because you have to buy like at least two sets, and then you know constantly be charging them. And I don't know, it's just kind of a hassle. So I don't I don't really want to do that. I'm thinking about using all my Walmart gift certificates and buying some uh, Triton AX Pros. And uh, I've looked into Astros a lot. And they look pretty nice. They look pretty fancy, but um, as far as what I've, what I was talking about with people last night, they say that they're the uh, simulated surround sound. They're not actually true surround sound. It's just one speaker in each ear cup. Um, the Triton AX Pros they actually have four speakers in each in each ear, a subwoofer, and then three directional um, speakers, which sound pretty sweet. So. I guess I'm just going to spend all my gift card money and get a new fucking headset, even though I've only had the X41s for like a couple months. But, oh well. I want to have a headset that I'm happy with. You know, so. I think I'm going to do that. You'll probably see an unboxing video. Um, what else? Uh, let's see, I got a, uh, I got a, uh, the GoldenEye, GoldenEye, 007 GoldenEye for Wii. Uh, I was a big fan of the original one for 64. It was one of the first consoles I had, and I played the shit out of GoldenEye split screen with my friends, like paintball mode and big head mode and all that crap. And Golden Gun and stuff. It was a hell of a game. So uh, I was pretty excited to see the re the uh, the remake of it or whatever, and uh, got it for Christmas with the little gold with the little golden controller and stuff. I haven't even played it yet though, because uh, my girlfriend's been hogging the Wii because I bought her. Uh, the new Donkey Kong Country, and she's been playing the shit out of that. But yeah, other than that, I, you know, I got some, uh, you know, some cologne and a little bit more money, and you know, nothing really too crazy. 
So, um, but I definitely want to hear what you guys got. So uh, go ahead and scroll down there, and leave a comment, tell me what you got for Christmas, and uh, maybe I'll I'll pick the I'll pick the coolest gift out of all the comments and which one I'm most jealous of. But uh, yeah, a while back on Black Friday I bought another TV, so it's kind of Christmas for myself. I bought a I went to Black Friday at like 1:30 in the afternoon, not even really expecting to buy anything, and uh, ended up buying a LG 42 inch. TV and uh, Blu-ray player, LG Blu-ray player for like 70 bucks or something. It was marked down pretty far, so um, and I got like six Blu-ray DVDs or Blu-ray. That's I'm fucking retarded. Blu-ray movies. So yeah, you know I'm getting my Blu-ray on. That's that's what's going on. But anyways, so so what'd you guys get? Leave a comment. I'd like to I'd like to know. Not in a weird like stalker way, but you know I'd like to know. Okay, for real, okay. Anyways. So, uh, I'll talk about the gameplay a little bit here. I'm using, like I said, I'm, I already told you I'm using 7.4U. Uh, I think it was Hutch, and or somebody, I don't know, uh, put a video up a while back that the 7.4U, or maybe you just tweeted, I don't know. But uh, anyways, said that um, rapid fire on the 7.4U is pretty much like stopping power. And uh, I rolled with that for a while, and it is pretty, pretty goddamn awesome as someone would say but I don't like how fast you run out of ammo and you can't use rapid fire with extended mags at the same time with Warwood so um, I eventually switch back to just the regular I like just using extended mags um, so you can have longer sprays and stuff as newbie as that is but uh, yeah and then my killstreak setup here was the uh, blackbird and then chopper gunner and dogs and it kind of goes back to the same concept in Modern Warfare 2. If you can get that 7-man kill streak and get your Harrier, then you can pretty easily get your AC-130 and then your Nuke. Well, it's the same thing in Black Ops. If you can get that Blackbird, it's really easy to get another kill for your Chopper Gunner. And not too hard to get your dogs after that. So, uh, anyways, wow, I'm glad I went way into depth on gameplay here on this commentary. I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, the next little thing is Jehovah Vision. Click to watch the episode that you missed Seriously, guys, follow me on Twitter now. I post high-definition tweets every day, okay, for days, for weeks, possibly even for months, okay? Hide your kids, hide your... Follow me on Twitter.